Welcome to Solidarity TV, your destination for independent views, grassroots politics, and much more at American University and the Greater District. I'm your host, Mana Alibadi. Before we get to the good stuff, I'd like to take a moment to explain the premise behind Solidarity TV and why we've worked hard to create the show. Initially, we started to brainstorm around this idea after we realized that even though there are so many active student organizations on campus, not many of them know about each other's various campaigns and initiatives. So we chose the term solidarity because we want to help bridge these gaps of awareness between all student groups so that ultimately we can build a greater and much more organic sense of community at AU. In addition to building campus unity, we also want to bring underrepresented views and issues into the forefront of political discussion. This means going beyond the traditional framework of mainstream politics to talk about community issues and other issues that are rarely reported on. Reported on. Essentially, our vision for Solidarity TV is to create a platform through which we can promote alternative perspectives and build grassroots networks here at AU, DC, and abroad. And now we kick off the show with a highlight of our recent grassroots campus events. On Tuesday, October 16th, world-renowned Chilean student activist Camila Vallejo, Noam Titleman, and Noam Titleman came to AU. AU student Kate and Elmer were all part of a panel discussion about modern student movements and student union organizing. Vallejo and Noam stopped at AU as part of their trip to DC in order to accept the Latelier Mofit Human Rights Award from the Institute for Policy Studies. Solidarity TV was there Tuesday to cover the event. <laughs> And that no one could deny that we really needed to live in a more integrated society without such stark socioeconomic uh, differences, political, religious, ethnic, and that uh, we needed to do this in order to then reduce and do away with inequality. He said, we're going to change the system from within, but also from without, accompanied by a broad social and political alliance. Yeah. All right, well, we're here after the event with Camila Vallejo, Caden Elmer, and Noam Teitelman. Um, we're going to talk to some students now. Uh, my name is John De La Sola. I'm a freshman slash sophomore, don't really know. Um, I'm here because I think AU really needs to treat its students better. Um, and I feel like the Chilean student movement and our student movement here at AU are pretty similar. I think it's not just a like an issue of like one school. It's a broader movement within the whole United States that we need to work on. And I think if we start here at AU, we can broaden it out. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about that patch you're wearing right now? Okay, um, so the patch is from the Montreal protests in Montreal. Um, where they went on strike for tuition increases and they used the symbol. Um, and we're taking it as a, like a sign of solidarity with them. Um, they actually managed to get their tuition freeze. Um, so we just think it's a very powerful symbol. Um, so I decided to come because I've been following the Chilean movement for a little more than a year at this point, maybe a year and a half. And uh, so I was intrigued on that front. But I was also interested because I wanted to know how to build movement uh, in general, like collectively, what that process looks like, but also getting to see successful modern contemporary activists um, to see what has sustained them personally too. And I guess that's why I asked that question was because uh, it's you rarely get opportunity to see contemporary activists uh, up close and really get a chance to interact with them. So seeing that they're regular people like we are and uh, that, you know, they, that they took a moment of opportunity and seized it to the best of their ability, which is, I suppose, the best that any of us can do. So it was good to hear that story directly and to, um, and to get to interact with that. Sure. Uh, my name is Marcus Hoopy. Uh, I'm a senior here at, uh, in the School of, S uh, School of International Service. 
Um, I'm here today because I think schools in the United States really need to show solidarity for the student movements that are happening around the world. Um, students around the world have, have began these movements to uh, lower tuition prices and to make uh, education a universal right to all students.